Hello and welcome, my beautiful Pisces, my mermaids and mermen, my sea sponges of the sea. Brenda here with your general daily vibe message from your guides for January the 19th. So let's jump right in here and see what we've been given. You've been given the card thorns and it says weave together the crown you deserve. So this, you know, this right here is the ultimate card of celebration right now. And we need to step up and realize that we're worthy of having a good time here. Not just for yourself. You're amazing, though. But that those around you deserve to be celebrated, too, and have some fun with. Um, you know, when you're putting down on your crown, each and every morning, go and help someone else put on theirs. You have so much love, Pisces, and wisdom to spread, so don't waste it. Self-love is essential, but community is important, too. So this is about us being of service to others. This is about us stepping up. And, and today, tell somebody how nice they look if you think they do. Uh, give somebody a compliment randomly. Smile more at somebody. Be there for them. And, you know, commend them and compliment them on something today because it brings us a lot of pleasure when we bring someone else pleasure so when we feel good about ourselves, when we get up in the day we need to take that energy out and sprinkle that out into the universe and spread that joy we feel about ourselves and apply it to other people too so this is a day where you're going to be maybe wanting to spend time with somebody and tell them what you think about them and tell them how well they're doing and tell them how proud of them you are now, coming in with that, you've got the Queen of Wands, and she's that queen that has been through so many challenges, and she has that ability. She's walked through the fire, she's come out the other side, and she's determined to go for her goals and find her happiness. This queen, basically, she flips the bird at anybody that doubts her, anybody that tries to put their two cents worth in and their opinion to sway her decisions to go after her goals and her happiness. She says, no, I'm going to do this. I'm not going to fail at it, and I'm going to go and listen to myself here. This is my journey my personal journey and she says to everybody she holds her chin up and she says watch me so definitely this is a day where you're going to be going after something here that you truly want and you may have been working on it for a while my Pisces but this is a day to stand up for yourself to be determined to do that due diligence and go after something that you're passionate about because it's only then that we do find we succeed at it now coming in in the center position we have that card villain so this is an interesting card um Basically, this, you know, it says you can always rewrite your story. So no matter how hard things get for us, we have that ability to take a negative and make it into a positive. We have that ability to take that lesson and move forward and do something different. It's a hard truth to swallow sometimes when our villains win, when our demons come in, you know, our, our, our negative energy. And that's what I call the demons. I don't, you know refer to them as any entity but you know when that energy comes in that's negative and toxic that doesn't mean that we should give up or lose all our hope because of it it just means that it's time to rewrite our story and to keep going forward it can be incredibly freeing and empowering to reclaim ourselves after a personal tragedy so it's moving on it's doing the work it's being due diligent it's realizing that we're worthy of starting a new beginning turning the chapter to go do something new today and so if you've dealt with something here in the past you're going to be able to move forward now we have the two of pentacles and that says balance right um you might be juggling something here juggling back and forth the thoughts in your mind do i do this or do i do that do i go here or do i go there do i make this choice or do i make that choice so the two of pentacles says you could be juggling things around maybe you're juggling your time you need to do better time management today maybe we need to write things down and tick them off rather than jump from one situation to another which is totally stressful and we can't always give a hundred percent of our time to something by doing that so today might be good time management and writing things down now there could be two offers two choices two decisions and two options coming in or two doors of opportunity opening up for us that we have to walk through i think these choices and decisions you're going to make are going to be easy for us. We're going to be able to look at what's going to bring us to our greater good and taking our time, realizing we're going to take ourselves to center, be balanced before we, and not jump into something too quickly. We may be healing and overcoming something here in our past that has left us a little dubious and doubtful, but we're going to move on from it and learn from it. Coming in next, we have the clover. And the clover says, release your guilt. So if you've been dealing with something, maybe there was something set out of context with a friend or a family member, and you walked away in the heat of the moment, and afterwards you've had time to think about it and process it, and you're thinking, mm, that wasn't a good thing to say or do. 
Um, you might be feeling guilty about a situation today. Maybe you've been carrying the burden of guilt on your shoulders far too long about a situation in your past. It's now negatively impacting all facets of our lives and making it impossible to function. And when we carry that guilt, we carry that negative energy with us and we haven't dealt with it and cleared it and forgiven it and thrown it out into the universe or had closure with whoever this energy was circulated around, it will do that. So we need to go ahead and make our reparations or release ourselves from the, the, the cage we've built around ourselves in this guilt. So sometimes the first road leads back around to the second, right? So um, this often happens to us and we need to realize that there may be something here we have to have closure with. So if you've had an issue with somebody, you know, whether we need to make amends or we have to have closure or we need to discuss it, be the one to make the first call today, Pisces. Don't allow yourself to sit and, and, and you know, take in all that, that guilt and that's going to hold you back from enjoying your day today. Coming in with that, you have the Seven of Cups, which is making choices. It's, you know, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Who do I pick? Well, the Seven of Cups says you're going to make a command decision and you're going to choose the right choice uh, today. And you're going to p choose the one that's going to bring you to your greater good. And that might be getting together with somebody here. That might be making amends. That might be getting over the guilt, okay? Uh, you're definitely moving in a new direction here. Uh, whatever these, these choices are that you're having to make, you're thinking about. It. you're going to be balanced about it you're going to take your time about it but you will make the right one wow well okay let's recap this so getting together and helping other people today being determined to go towards your goals um always knowing that out of a tragedy we can find a lesson learned and we can we can move forward from it um, and not allow that to happen and take over our demeanor again. There's choices and decisions here with both these cards and you will make the right one, I feel, today if you take your time and you process it and you think about it. Releasing the guilt today. If there's any situation, my beautiful Pisces, you're dealing with, let go of that guilt. You don't deserve to carry it. And if you deal with it head on and you face the root, you look at the root problem here and the situation and you deal with it, you're going to release it. You're going to surrender to having freedom again to go after what's important to you and to us because I'm a Pisces too. Um, so this is all about uh, today. And I do think all about today, uh, making the right choices and decisions that is going to free you to, to enjoy every moment today. So be the first one to make the first call, Pisces. Clear the air. Make amends. Have closure. Let go of that guilt. If you're carrying any today, you don't deserve to carry it all this time. It's time to close that door. And if nothing else, ask spirit and the universe to take it away. Throw it out into the universe with forgiveness and release it. Well, my beautiful fellow Pisces, my mermaids and mermen, my sea sponges of the sea, this is our daily vibe message today for January the 19th. And I wish you all a beautiful, prosperous, healthy, and happy day. And I send you lots of love and wish many blessings. See you soon, my Pisces.